Hey, what's up guys, Ara here, and welcome back to a brand new video here today, and welcome to Playing Grid 2019 Career Mode. Grid 2019 is finally out, the reboot of the Grid series from Codemasters. Today, we kick off the Career Mode, so if you go on to enjoy the video, be sure to smash the like button, but let's get into it then. Grid 2019 Career Mode, let's get into it. What can top the WSR? How can you top this season? On the road to the Grid World Series, we can expect more action, more drama, and it's all happening right here in the WSR. All right, so here we go. This looks like the introduction races to the career. It's kind of in the mood, I guess, as we go to the three red lights, and we're on the way here in a uh, beautiful yellow Corvette, as it were, and uh, won the spectacular city circuits, I guess, on the game, basically, but uh, we're going to try and obviously aim for first place. I don't know what the AI are going to be ex exactly like. Obviously, very erratic and punchy, I'm guessing, but uh, let's see how this Corvette drives out. I can already feel feeling a bit heavy, but let's see how we do right now. I'm kind of getting stuck in peace there. Jesus! Right, already a crash then has occurred. There's been a blockade on the minimap, you can see, so straight away, that's taking what? 10 seconds, 15 seconds of be an almighty crash, and I've almost rear-ended that guy. As we just about get it through, scrape through the wall. We've got flashbacks enabled, so I, have, I think I have about five I can use, I think, overall. They might be needed uh, at some point, because, uh, like I said, the AI might be a little bit arsy here and, here and there. But it was send one down the inside, trying to get P3 if we can. And we're smashing them out of the way. P2 obtained, and now we're chasing after another yellow. I think that's a Ferrari, I think. Uh, 458, is it? Is that the 458? I think so. Oh, my... Okay. Um... Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe look, look where you're going and don't look at other, yeah, mm. Yeah, we're just gonna edit that one out, that never, that never happened, it, you didn't see anything there, I didn't just look behind way too long and smash straight into the barrier, that definitely didn't happen, but we're up into first place, but, very tricky circuit here, trying to slow down this Corvette, and Jesus, I've really dented the, the front end already, but we're on lap two, so we're actually not too far away, they're already coming through to the last stretch here, as we kind of loop, actually, actually, hang on, yeah, it's a, it's a loop, uh, not an actual figure eight loop, as uh, we're going underneath the bridge we just drove over, but we're nearly through onto the last part there, and we should be fine up into first place. I imagine these first intro races are maybe a little bit easier than uh, what the actual uh, races in the actual career will be. This is the kind of introduction, so I'm sure kind of a little bit of a, a, t a taster, like I said, rather than the full-on one. I'm pretty sure I've got the AI on uh, on very hard. That's the highest difficulty you can have there. So I think uh, we should be fine um, for that. But uh, it's first place here in this first race. So I was a taster of, uh, well, GT cars, I guess, I think. You're going to have to excuse me on, on actual, like, car classes. I'm horrendous at that. And Kristen, it's got to be the one to watch. Yeah, you won't want to miss it, Alex. The Grid World Series is so close you can touch it. I reckon there's going to be a brawl out there to make it through. Alright, looks like we're going to NASCAR. Some American Oval Racing. Obviously, we've been very well trained for this. We did some uh, Formula NASCAR Championship in F1. Uh, it's all been training for this. You're about to see my, my skills come out in full force, I think, as there's been a horrendous crash. Clearly, I must have caused it, I'm guessing. Uh, no, actually, no. I'm, it, it, oh, we're doing a Survive episode in the middle of Grid. Fantastic. Look at this. Oh, look at that. I would be proud of that if I did that and survive. I honestly, I, I never do that and survive. I, I would basically get hit by that car. So that was wonderful. Right. So come on, capitalize on it. Okay, engineers say I don't know how on earth I got through it. I don't know how on, how on earth I got through it as well, man. But here we go. We've got two laps to try and get to first place. Got to try and draft these guys, get in the slipstream. Do a bit of bump drafting like we've learned from former NASCAR championship videos. And try and get the lead if we can. But first of all, let's catch up. Nice and tight on the line, then go wide. Go very close to the wall, but don't touch it. Then get in the slipstream. Gaining, gaining. We're going to try and hold on here. I'm going to actually pull to the right here, try and go on the outside, but a bit of a wobble and a bit of a shake as I get out of the slipstream. But we're on the outside there, lift off a little bit. It's a bit of a slide, but we control, my lord. Right, maybe we, maybe we don't do that. Maybe we let off and uh, let them slide, uh, scrape the wall. That's iffy. That's very, very iffy. Right, see, now I'm in first place, and now they're, they're chasing me. So this is this is not good. I'm now the one giving them the toe. But would it really be me playing random games on the channel without me having some sort of spin? I think I've done it on every single Retro F1 game I played. I think I did it on the truck racing game we played. And now we're doing it on Grid 2019. It wouldn't be any other way, would it? But to be fair, I'm actually doing quite well here. I'm pulling away. 
quite quickly here. Broken the toe. Broken that one second gap. There's no DRS, but I'm going to pretend like one second's the magic gap number. I think we should be fine as long as I don't just don't stuff this into a wall at some point. And that sun glare doesn't absolutely blind me. Jesus. Right, through last... Is this the last bend? I think, I think it is. Through to the last place. Just take a bit of the inside there. And there we go. Turtling across into the last bend. And through to the line. Where is the fanfare? Where's my fanfare? There it is. Across the line. It's first... Oh, some lovely, colourful... Uh, what do you call it? Paint grenades going off. And we're first place there. NASCAR. Job done. What's the last one? Settled in Brands Hatch, Kristen. The clouds may be grey, but the action will be as colourful as ever, especially given the added complexity of a waterlogged road surface. If you can win in these conditions and under this pressure, well, you are prime Grid World Series material. Okay, that sounds like me. The final is about to begin, so hold on to your umbrellas. It's race day. Okay, wet racing. Let's go. Let's go. Is there a reason why they're all Australian in the commentary box here? Uh, uh, is, is that like a theme going on here? Like, why are we at Brands Hatch and they're, they're just they've got the thickest Aussie accents ever? And is that is that me? Did I just? Even the game knows that I need to be spinning out in these videos. It's set it up for us. Look at this. Okay, it's like a little cutscene here. We've got scenario mode going on, right? So we've span out, which is normal for me. So they've got that to an absolute T there, to be fair, Cody's. Um, and now we get going from P9 and try to see what we can do. Aim for at least a top three, I think it is. But we'll try and see if we can get more. Can I dive down the inside of this man? Olivier's my... Oh my god, my car is already shedding weight there as the bonnet goes. Ollie's squeezed me out. An absolute treat. Side by side. For P9, can we get to P8 down the inside? Come on, we've got to shoot it there. Lift off. Power, power, power. Good. And oh, he's gone. He's gone on the left. Nick White, absolute loser he is. I, oh, I think you are actually might. I think that might be my teammate. He had a green icon. I think that, yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, our teammate span as well. So as a team, we're not doing too well. Both of us have span out. I obviously got cutscened into the spin. Nick just naturally did that because I don't think that was part of the, the script of the race here, but let's try and see now. We're literally bump drafting John, taking the skills from NASCAR into this, uh, what is it, touring cars, I think. I think it is, uh, brand Satch, but we're going to send one to the inside here. Hopefully don't get spun out on the wet curb. And I, I now this next right-hander is absolutely deadly. Anytime it's on Brands Hatch. This is just a nightmare because it's so blind, so quick. But we've made it work up into third place. You know what? We're making very good progress here. Can we shoot it around the outside? Oh, it gives me some space, but a bit of a wobble there on the front end. But this car's got a lot of good grip on the, on the front end there. So I can just kind of chuck it in and kind of power on. And that will kind of help steer the car in as we go through the last corner. Use a bit of grass there. And we're good. Now onto the main straight. Closing up to Davi. Right, should we just absolutely send this then? Absolutely go for it. Into turn one. We close right up to him. Are we going to make the move to the inside? Yes, we are. Pull to the inside. Will he cut us up? Big break zone. Looks like we've done it. Looks like we've done it. Nice and easy. Oh, you know what? I need to I need to probably check the um, the, the settings here. Because I, I did have to reset the save to, to re... Basically, essentially, when I started recording this, it just went straight into this. And so I had to click reset to basically redo, like, you know, actually have an intro to the video and then do this career mode. So I think it might have reset all the settings. I have a sneaking suspicion the AI aren't on very hard anymore. But we move, we, we, we adapt, and we overcome, and we just continue going on. Right, yeah, I just checked the settings just then. You wouldn't have seen it because I cut it out of the video. But I just checked the settings. They were indeed reset. So we've been playing on medium AI, this has been. And to be fair, I only just managed to get the uh, the win in that, in that first race on medium medium there. Obviously, it was a little bit easier with the NASCAR race, and we're absolutely mooring them right now. We're like Jamie Chadwick at Brands Hatch in the W Series. Doing quite well. I mean, she didn't win it. She didn't win at Brands Hatch, but obviously smashing it in W Series. But uh, basically that, that equivalent there. But uh, now the AI from the next race will be on very hard. So we got through the tutorial. So pat on the back there with maybe some minor spins and flashbacks. And now we're going to come through the last bend and enter the proper grid 2019 career. Very hard. Highest AI difficulty. Let's go get it, shall we, as we come across the line for maybe the last fanfare. You never know. I don't know how hard, very hard is, but first place there. We're, we're ready. We're ready to take on the Grid World Series. Excellent season. You're going to dominate the Grid World Series. You've got the sponsorship lined up, so it's all down to talent now. 
Captain, now you're the expert, but from where I was sitting, that was a final to remember. From a mid-race spin-out to an electrifying finish, this race and the WSR series has given us plenty to look back on. But what's next? Well, next for those skilled enough to have got this far, Alex, and made it to the top of the standings, is the Grid World Series. If the WSR is the proving ground, then the Grid World Series is the battleground, where the best racers on the planet compete in multiple race disciplines to find out who is the ultimate racer. Well, I can't add anything more to that, Kristen. So, as the dust settles on the WSR today, in the distance, the Grid World Series starts its engines, gearing up for the most thrilling racing action around. And we'll be right there with you. Right, so we are ready to dive into the actual grid career mode. We got past the very easy part and still managed to make a few mistakes. But anyway, so here we are then. So this is the how the career is based. Then we've got the Grid World Series. We have to complete four showdown events. Those are the events right at the end of these little tier trees. So we've got Touring Cars, uh, Stock, Tuna, GT, Fernando Alonso Racing Challenge, and then an Invitational. So I probably will be going for a selection of the Touring Car, Tuna, GT, and Fernando Alonso ones because I don't really fancy doing stock car racing because uh, there's going to be a lot of understeer in those but I don't know let me know in the comments below which ones you might want to see me do but we're going to I think start off with the Fernando Alonso challenges. I think it makes sense. It's an F1 channel mostly. So it makes sense to kind of do the Fernando Alonso tier first. And then I think we'll just kind of move upwards to GT, Tuna. And then maybe end off with touring before we finish off hopefully getting to the Grid World Series. I do want to really get through everything uh, in this game. I don't. I, I, there's a, it's a bit of a meme on this channel I know. And a meme on a lot of F1 channels that we do other racing games. We play one episode of four and stop it. I did it with MotoGP as well. But I genuinely want to try and get through to the end of this this game so I'm going to be trying to record quite a lot in bulk and so you might have quite chunky episodes but I want to try and get through it all we have to I, don't, I think you have to only win a certain amount of these races and you already unlock the, the the showdown so it's not like a, a long long slog grind I don't think so I think we should be able to get through it quite well so we're going to start off here with the Fernando Alonso tier urban f1000 series we've got to finish third or above it's two rounds let's get into this first one uh, in terms of car we have to actually buy our car first we've got uh, 100,000 credits up top. This one costs 70,000, so not too much there. So we have to purchase it to actually enter the series. So that's all fine. So we can actually customize it as well then with the livery. So we've actually got uh, some selections here that are locked right now. We've got the Raven West one. That's a that's a throwback. That is, uh, where is it? There we go. That's the uh, that's the old school, obviously, from the old original grid Raven West. Then we've got the FA uh, uh, livery looking lovely as ever. And then you've got the uh, Camo one, obviously sponsor of Fernando Alonso. But right now, I don't have any of that unlocked. But we can choose some stripes. Look at these. Look at these. All the all the options here. Cust oh, flames. Got to go with flames, surely, just for the meme of uh, how... Oh, that, actually, you know what? That one looks sick. These are, these are actually some pretty decent designs here, actually, you know. Um, can I can I get this one? Customize? Yep. Okay, what color do we want? I'm going to go with red. Right, I like the look of that. That's our little baby for our very first career race in grid. I'm good with that. Select. Let's go. Right. Urban F1000 series. We've got Shanghai, the Oriental Pearl Circuit. And where are we on the grid? I'm going to guess we're going to be in La. I also, I, th I think I'm still player one. Because I don't think I've actually done any of my details in the game. But I think that's quite fitting. Because every time we've played random games so far this year on the channel, I've always been player one. I mean, it's so simple. Who needs names, all right? Just player one. That's it. All right, Oriental Pearl Circuit. We're P14 on the grid. We go to our first race in our career at this Chinese circuit, and uh, we have to try and get a top three position. Our teammate, Nick White, the man who crashed out with us at Brands Hatch is there, but we've sent it to the inside, and I've absolutely just I've crunched someone. I've got a nemesis now of Alexis. He's in uh, Alexa, Alexa, what on earth is that name? Alexi? He's in P16 now, so it doesn't really matter to me too much. We're up into P6, though. That was a brilliant dive. I mean, we made some contact, but it was still a brilliant dive, I feel. Um, and now we move on. We've got three laps. We've got to try and make three positions at least, minimum. I think I've got a car, but oh my god, he's absolutely done me. What? Mateo, absolutely done me. Oh, and the braking. I feel like I may have dented my brakes at some point. Maybe in that first crash, perhaps. Or maybe it's just this car. I think it might just be the car. Right, on the outside, feather it, feather it. Good stuff. P6, back up into there. Try and send this through. Oh, he's slow, he's slow, he's slow. A little bit of rubbing between uh, P5 and P4. 
I'm going to go to the inside again. Seemed to work out for us quite well. I've made a new nemesis of Tanaka. I'm going to have to keep going side by side with him. It's wheel to wheel stuff. Three wide nearly. I think that's Louise in P3 trying to get us. But we're into P1 now. I've maybe not... I've, I've, I've basically just hit everyone off to do it. But we've made it work. Oh, he's on my inside. He's on my inside. And he's my nemesis. So he's not going to be very kind to me. I think when they're your nemesis, they, real, they will try and hit you a little bit. So you can see there, he's right up my chuff now. This will be for a whole lap here. He's going to be right on my tail. Here he comes. Here he comes. He's lurking. He's lurking. Right. Going to actually take this corner properly now and, and break. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Bit of a slide there. Massive slide, but we've still held it. Oh, we've just about kept kept it here, there, even though we went massively wide. Oh, he's there. He's there on the, on, the, on the left. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? He's going to try and send one to the inside. Yes, he will. Oh, he's made the dive. He was there. We've kept him at bay, though. Kept him at bay. Last two corners. Don't lose it there. Don't lose it there. We're good. We're good. He slowed up. He slowed up. Through to the line. And we're going to start things off with the first place. All right, so all good. First race, and we've already already made a rival then. Um, I think that carries forward, I think, also into the second race. So here we go to Havana now, and uh, we might have a very feisty... Um, I can't even remember the name. He's literally that irrelevant to me. I don't remember his name, but he's going to be at, he's gonna be mad at me. He's going to be my nemesis in this second race now, but that's fine. That's fine. Right, Havana. I believe this is one of the new circuits they made. Uh, all new for this game. Right, let's go. Skip. We're P16 then. Player one. Come on. We're underway. It's an okay start there. Right, don't know where this circuit goes. Again, going to have to learn it. Right, right. We're going to... Is it a light break? Light... Oh, my lord. The rear end stepped out there. Okay, we're P15. Only one place gain. That's not good enough right now. Arif. We need to go around the outside. Try and get some speed going here. Nick, Nick White. We're going to nip to the inside here. P9. Lovely stuff there. Lovely little nip there. Right. Our teammates there. Where on earth is a nemesis? Have we, made, have we kept one from the first race or are we going to need to make new ones? I mean, I'm all for making new ones. I mean, I can definitely do that. As we go around the outside. Oh, Dawn Eden. A little bit of contact there with Jao. Can we send it to the inside? Oh, I may have just punted him to the wall a little bit. We're cool. We're now catching up to Dawn Eden. Oh, break, break, break zone here. Easy, easy, easy. Drift it. Gain some momentum there. Good stuff. Right. Dylan Jenkins, you're mine, mate. We've got Dawn Eden on the left. Jenkins on the right. We're going to splice them down the middle as we want to lap number two then. Wheel to wheel. Ooh, very close on the right there. Going to have to lift off a little bit, try and break a little bit later. We've got Jow next. But, oh, he's come back around me. Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, absolutely just sent it to the barrier there. And the crowd was probably going to be terrified for seeing the front end of the car just slam into the barrier like that. Right. I need to try and get past these three if I can in one swift move here into this corner. Good, good, not good. Oh, they've come back at me. They're coming back at me very much so, actually. They're being very feisty on lap number two. And this is a lot bumpier than I remember on lap number one. Come on. Oh, come on. Right. Isn't there a big break zone coming up, I think? Yes, there is. Right. Send, 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 send. Use you as a wall. Thank you very much. Dylan Jenkins going to come through. Oh, the AI is slow here. Through the last one, they're slow. Right. Pull in through. Up into P. Is this P3 for us? Yes, this is what we need. We need this position minimum. And we're through. Yep, we've got Jenkins. This corner. Big break zone. Oh, we tapped this guy. No. Oh, did a bit of a Tom Cruise there. Two wheelers on the left. Easy does it, though. Through into second. We can get first. We can still get first. We're just about catching him. Petrov. All right, big right-hander. Uh, easy does it. No, 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 no. Back end steps out a bit. We're good, we're good. Oh, they're right on my chuff. Right, this this next section is actually really a lot of fun, but also difficult because the AI are very good at it. I just need to get, be near enough, though, because that last corner, AI, bit slow through there. We can try and catch them up there. Here, this is very much, ooh, a little bit like Havana Monica. Monica? Monaco, basically. Right, last corner. Send it here. Try and gain some speed. It's good. Floor it. Floor it. We're catching up to Petrov. Come on. Like this. Yes, come on. The dramatic on the line for first place. Oh, yes. We've done it in style on the last lap. Last corner. Just across the line. Petrov. Go suck yourself. We got first place. Boom. Decent. All right, first place there. 
Uh, we also got ahead of our rivals. Fast lap as well on that one as well. And the team bonus for the uh, team finishes in first place in the event as well. That's pretty sick. Nice little podium sequence. Player one has won that first event. And now we unlock the next two. Um, so I believe for the showdown, what do we have to do? We have to complete face-off one and face-off two. We need to complete the international 1,000. Okay, so there's pairings of two. Okay, so I've sussed it out. So you do one and you unlock two then. So there's pairings of two. So you only actually have to do one of these and you continue on that one. So, you know, this one's thunder down under. That will unlock this one. And then that unlocks this one. But that's going to be it for me then for this first episode of our Grid 2019 career. So guys, if you did enjoy it, then be sure to smash that like button. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. And let me know actually what kind of a, a, a episode length you guys would prefer. You know, around the 20 minute mark like the, today's episode. Or would you prefer longer ones with more races in? Maybe you kind of rattle through the career mode faster in a way. If we are doing more races per episode. Or do you just kind of prefer the kind of kind of a good region of 20 minutes? I don't know. Let me know in the comments below about that. And if you are new around here, do get subscribed for more videos. Videos from Grid 2019. Till then, guys, hope you enjoy the rest of the day. Goodbye.